my hair is still a little bit wet from getting out the shower so i've just like shoved it up so basically just excuse what it looks like but i've been getting ready and something that i've absolutely been loving recently and i've been getting so many comments about on my recent pictures about how i'm doing my brows now because i think my brows look a lot better than they have done in the past and it's actually down to benefit i always rave about all of benefit brow products but they've just launched this new product which is called the brow styler this product is so simple to use and it can actually create up to three different brow looks obviously everyone has their own preference on what brows they like whether or not it be like a tidy neat shape brows which you can definitely do with the waterproof wax pencil if you use it on its own otherwise if you like more like me like soft fluffy brows then you can definitely use the loose powder on its own and it can give you that look and then again if you like your brows you know a bit more bold darker deeper brows then you can use the pencil and the powder together so I thought I would show you how I would do my brows, even though my brows are very odd. I'm actually going to start off by just using this little brush that I use and swear by every single day by benefit. Just to brush my brows into some sort of shape. But I do actually need to fill my brows in a lot because they are very uneven and I haven't got much brow here. How I would usually fill in my brows is I start by outlining the shape that I want. And with this pencil that is so easy to do so. If you wanted to get your hands on the brow styler, then it's actually in store from the 27th of September and online globally. And wow, look at the difference already. Literally just from penciling the shape. So this is what the other side of the brow styler looks like. The powder side, it's easier just to kind of like smudge it in. So I just kind of put the powder in random places and just kind of like fill in the gaps. Pretty much would use it the same way that I use the pencil. And then just with my fingers, just lightly smudge it in and it gives it more of like a fluffier look. As you can clearly see, I've used the brow styler on one brow. I could keep going in, make them darker, make them more defined. And I could also make them a little bit more fluffier, which I might do, but it depends kind of how my makeup look is going to go. I don't know if I'm going to be more natural natural today when I go out. But at the moment, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with my makeup. So as you can see, this is the difference between the brows and it's literally taking me like, I would say 30 seconds to do this. I personally prefer like more natural, fluffier brows. I just think it just looks, you know, softer, nicer. For me, Cara Delevingne brows, the perfect brows. Today I use the shade 3.5. In the past I've been using the shade 3. So if you want to use the same shade as me or if you have the same sort of hair or whatever then I use the shade 3.5. I will leave the link if you guys want to check out the brow styler down in the description box down below. Definitely do so as it is a great product and now I'm going to carry on doing my makeup and finish my other brow. Situation. I finished my makeup and put some curls in my hair. It's actually a little bit later on in the day. I haven't really done much this morning. I've been really unproductive. I've just slowly been getting ready and <coughs> I'm still a little bit ill. I've been ill the past couple of weeks. Not couple of weeks. The past week. And I'm still just kind of feeling it. Like I just cannot stop blowing my nose and I just... <coughs> <laughs> As you can tell, I have a bad cough. I'm just not really feeling it today. But I really, really, really just want to keep getting out the content for you guys. If you are subscribed to my main channel, I always uploaded every Wednesday and every Sunday. But just because I've got so much going on at the moment, I'm just finding it really hard to balance. But it's going to be fine. I'm still going to upload a lot. However, it might not necessarily be Wednesdays and Sundays. It might just be like random days of the week. So just bear with me. If you're subscribed, then you still hopefully won't miss a video. And I've still been uploading weeks. Weekly. So I hope you guys have been enjoying that. But yeah, to just kind of give you like more of a little bit of an update. That is the situation. I am about to film a video now though for my main channel. And then after that, I think I'm going to film a video of my dad. My dad and I filmed branded versus non-branded food. And it was so good. But I ended up losing the footage. So we're going to do it again pretty much. And I'm going to have to get like different foods that we haven't tried in the last video. Because I don't want it to be unfair. But it is such a good video. And I love watching people do those sort of videos. So I'm hopefully today going to try and get that film with my dad as well. So do look out my main channel. There is still content coming your way, but it might not necessarily be on the days that they have always been. I'm going to try and still keep it Sundays and Wednesdays, but it might just be a random day of the week. On other news, I feel like a lot of you are really enjoying all the vlogs recently, so happy about that. Current situation, I have cloves 
here, there and everywhere. I've been filming, I filmed two videos. It's been a productive, a productive few hours. I am gonna pretty much tidy up, sort my room out and stuff now, and then we're gonna head out for dinner. All of us family are going out, and as you guys know, Casey, Harlow and Nicole were staying here, so they're gonna come up with us as well. Then we're gonna go to ZZ's and get a pizza. Our first plan was to go and get a roast, but not many places actually do roast in the evening, which almost a little bit bizarre. Most like places around Brighton, if you wanna get a roast, you can only really get them till like 4 p.m. For that reason, we're gonna go out and get a pizza at ZZ's, which I'm still not complaining about. I would. Oh, I can starve a pizza right now. Also, I have quite a few packages that have come in the post, so I definitely do want to do an unboxing, but I wanted to show you this one from one of my really good friends, Jake Jamie. He has just launched another new face mask, and to be honest, I actually think this one's going to be my favourite. This is, oh, hang on, it's all sealed up. This is Sticky Toffee. Okay, give me a minute. This is Sticky Toffee Apple, and this is his limited edition Halloween face mask, so if you haven't got your hands on it, definitely do go and do so. I'm sure they would set out so fast. Last time when he brought out these face masks, they just literally flew off the shelves. I also know you can get this online on ASOS as well, which is really good, but otherwise you can get them in stores. Ah, oh, and look at him. There he is. Hello is saying no. Why, Casey? She doesn't want to watch the football. She's you don't want to watch the football? You don't want to watch the football, Harlow? <laughs> this is so funny. Angry Birds has been on for 95%. Oh, look at her. We are going out for food and I'm so excited. Literally can't wait. Also, my hair tucked in looks strange. This reminds me of having short hair again and I kind of miss it. Bye bye, Bella. I love you. Harlow, who are you drawing? Who are you drawing? Can you draw a picture of Auntie Safi? Oh, look, it's so cute. She's not doing it now, but when she concentrates, she sticks her tongue out. Oh, I well, wish she was doing it right now. <laughs> it's so cute. Look <laughs> Just looked at the menu, and I'm going to be having literally this pizza, but then I'm going to add some pepper, I think. And last time, Mum got a starter. I can't remember what it was, but it was so good. What was that like, um, that starter that everyone had to share, ended up having to share? What's it called? These two. Yeah, they are a sharing platter and they are so good i can't even tell you so if you ever come to zz's if you're with like good people definitely try both of these oh, i've just drawn this her. Oh, and then harlow was pointing it and she went oh, harlow no. senior that's what she said look oh, is that you, you? No, let's that is so cute yeah. is it harlow there you go there you. yay who is it <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah that's me is it you don't need to draw me Ready? Oh, this is so cute. Harlow is officially vlogging. Oh, wait, she's stopped now. Good girl. Oh, look at her little face. <laughs> and look, she's even turning it off. This is my starter. It's so good. Literally just tomato, mozzarella, onion. That is huge. What have you got there, Dad? What's that? Something spicy, I think. Rust. Okay, I did not get that. But anyways, yeah, you can smell how hot that is. And mum, oh, yours looks, what is that? Is that pickle? Goat's cheese. Oh, that's my favourite. Oh, oh that's really? So that's your favourite? Yeah. So nice. Here is my dinner. Oh, this looks so good. And Casey, he's on a health kick at the moment. So he's got salmon and potatoes and salad. Nice one. Hi, Stephen. And happy. Sing? Food went down so well. And now we're going to go home and watch the results show. This is why I love where I live because look how pretty it is. And there's probably so much wind that you can't even hear. Look how snuggled our Carlo is. Oh, look at you. <laughs> we are just heading home. I literally can't believe, you can't even see me, but I can't even believe how cold it is now outside. Like, it is freezing. It's officially winter, guys. Look how cute Bella looks. Uh, passes to open Aww. buttons and beds. And I just felt that he was just... Hi. Ever since we've been home, I've been stretching, you know, trying to just be flexible. I've been told that I need to work on my kicks, so that's what I've been doing. So I've just been stretching stuff, got mum to help me out. So this is what I'm doing. I'm sitting here like this. Oh, you know, mum's sitting here, she's pushing my legs up. I'll take a picture from the back. We're going to take a picture from the back. As my head goes down <laughs> on the floor, 
literally right by, you know, my mum's, yeah, but in my face. <laughs> Not <laughs> once, but twice. Twice. I was in so much shock. They I was in wires, so actually, much yeah. I was in so much pain where she pulled me so far down, I couldn't even get up. So I'm down here and I literally have got, <laughs> and then she starts laughing. She's still holding my hand and this was it again. <laughs> and this was the moment. This was the exact moment because Nicole was taking a picture. I wish so was, just so you guys was recording. It, I really, I wish. really wish she was recording. My mum farted in my face. Not once, <laughs> but twice. Thank you, Wendy. I'm now mortified and never want to stretch again.